So previously we had looked at setting up Black Scholes model in C++ and um, we had used for Lopta as, uh, as a, if you like um, a source. So for Lopta uh, is hosted by Fabrice Rouen and Fabrice has um, a lot of code, C++ and other uh, uh, types of code available for download. Uh, previously I'd, I'd worked out the value of an option in VBA um, and in in, in Excel. Uh, so I'm going to take those parameter values and re-implement um, but in C++ and uh, instead of using Xcode um, I'm going to use um, uh, Visual Studio Express uh, 2015 and that's a free download directly from Microsoft. So um, going back then to um, our window, um, let's go to Visual Studio Express and um, of course I need the code also, so code that we use um, I'll go into Dropbox and Black Scholes C++ code. This is the same code that I had previously used uh, for Xcode, so we're going to have to make some changes. Um, from the time before and we'll copy copy that code and go back into Visual Studio new project and we want a Visual C++ Win32 Win32 console application I'll give it a name Black Scholes CH 1973. Hit OK. Next. Um, and untick and just tick empty project. So and finish. And uh, if you like, we have a blank canvas here, but before we can enter code, uh, we have to add a new item. And it's a C++ file, and also I'll call that Black Scholes 1973. Black Scholes 1973. And hit OK, or add. And then we come here to the code and I just paste in. So what I copied from the word or the text document I can add in. And it's parsing through uh, the code. It doesn't seem to be a problem. Um, and again the code I took from, where is the code? It's from Fabrice Rouen's uh, Volopta site. I just amended slightly the uh, code to um, to make the Black Scholes calculation. So we hit uh, we'll debug and execute the code. And we're getting some output. And in the debug window here we have Black Scholes price at 10.45.06 uh, same as what we had before so if I go back to um, <clears throat> where I'd made this calculation before and we look at now it's not here so if the download so if I download that code So I've downloaded and I've put into a Dropbox. So if I go into my own Dropbox, 
I take D and down again. And open up Dropbox and look for that file. Excel, Black Scholes, create this file. We can see that the an enable content. We, we can see for the parameter inputs of 100, um, S, K, T, R, Q, Sigma, 0 0.2, the value of the option is 1045.06. And if we compare that against our um, the debug value, so if we run this code again, the value when we execute the C++ code in Visual Studio Express 2015 for the call option, it's also 1045 as well. And I'll leave links on the YouTube, uh, just below the YouTube video where you can pick up on each of the files, the Word document and uh, the Excel file.